Trivia Tavarashi, what is going on everyone? This is Elkarlaw finally back here yet again with a brand new episode of Let's Play Minecraft Season 2, guys. And it has been a few weeks, I think about two weeks or so, since I did the last episode. And in today's video, I have a lot of things planned. I actually want to rebuild this entire village. I want to make it 100% mob proof. I also want to add a few more farms. Um, I'm going to get this village breeding system going so I could have more villagers, uh, you know, breeding in here and, and not have to worry about them getting killed by mobs and stuff. Um, and also, guys, today, in the next episode, um, what I wanted to mainly focus on next time was traveling on to that mountain range, which I showed you in the last video. And I'm going to set up a temporary base there, which is going to be, like, where I could store all my supplies when I'm working on my mansion. And, um, you know, like Vintage Beef, if you ever watched him on the Minecraft network, um... He always has like a temporary house right next to his builds he's doing, so that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing. Also today I'm working on um, probably fixing this building up, making a nice little entrance here, and uh, you know, just all that stuff like that. So the first thing is to start working on that village breeding system, and I think I have a, let's see, do I have a shovel here? I thought I had a shovel, in the last episode we went to the, uh, what's it called, nether. And we got a bunch of goodies here. I'm actually going to put those away. Got glowstone, nether bricks. I It was sort of an um, all over the place episode. I wasn't really focused on one thing. Um, I didn't get nether warts, so that is the one disappointment about that uh, adventure. But I could always go back, as you guys know. Let's put my fortune three away. Um, off camera, guys, I plan on collecting a lot of lumber and all that stuff. So I could get everything in order. Let's see, do I have a... Oh, I don't have a um, shovel, because when I went to the nether, my thing broke, and I fell off that cliff, if you guys remember. I got hit by that pig man, <laughs> which was a total mess. Um, so yeah, guys, I finished Grand Theft Auto V, and since then, really nothing has happened on my channel, because I want to... Um, basically, what I wanted to do was start my PS4 LPs, Killzone, Infamous Second Son, which I started playing. It is absolutely amazing. I'm also going to be doing Battlefield 4 commentaries because Battlefield 4 is way better than Call of Duty um, Ghosts. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to be doing a bunch of things, but I have to wait till the HDCP protection update comes out. And Sony did release a statement. It's going to be coming out very shortly, they said, um, within a few weeks or so. So that's when you guys are going to have to wait till my next you know, LP starts, which is going to be uh, Killzone, Infamous, and Battlefield series. So that's going to be really awesome. And before I actually break all of this grass, I'm going to work on building the actual thing here. It's a pretty simple breeding system. I saw this on a video. Um, I'm not sure if it's going to work, but let's just see and find out. Let's uh, wait for the best here. Let's get rid of all this grass. <clears throat> okay. Uh, let's go difficulty normal. Master volume 20. That's good. Okay, let's see. So far, we are at 3 minutes and 11 seconds. That's fine. Okay, um, so basically this goes like this, I think. There's a door here. And I think that's how it went. Something like this. Went like that. This is a pretty simple design, too. There was a wall on each side, and I think the doors went like this. It was pretty simple. Um, but basically what this does is it traps, or the villager sees all these doors, and it reacts with them. And it triggers his senses to, uh, you know, breed by himself because he sees all these doors. <laughs> this game's really messed up. It has to be, uh, too high, though. Just like this. So we'll make it too high. I like the dark wood color, so we'll just leave it at that. I think this is how it went. Oh, shit. I didn't want to put one there. Um, so yeah, guys, I'm going to be talking about Infamous in this video. Also, Battlefield 4, which I plan on playing tonight. I'm recording this on Saturday night, and I just got back from a, uh, a hockey game, which was really nice. Um, it was at the, it was at a place in my town, which is, you know, famous for having, like, famous concerts and stuff, so that's pretty cool. Let's get rid of this. So this video is going to be all over the place. I have a lot of stuff planned, <clears throat> or a lot of things planned in this episode, just like that. Okay, so he's going to see it. Get some torches out here. I hope this works. It should. Alright. Maybe we should keep the villager in a sectioned off area. Just in case it doesn't work. Yeah, we'll make a little area going around too. So he has nowhere to go. <clears throat> and uh, hopefully this works. Let's just go here. 
You know what? I could have put fences. Nah, let's just use dirt. Okay, we'll go there. That looks to be good so far. And that's the one thing I hate about living in a grassland is you have all this crap everywhere. But that's alright, I guess. It's a trade-off. Um, let's keep placing that. And I think that we should be good here. Let's, let's just do this, too, just to be safe. Okay, now I think he has nowhere to travel. Um, actually, let's go here. Let me do something. Let me go get more dirt. <clears throat> I'm going to pretty much need a lot of supplies for this thing. I want to see if this works. And uh, if it doesn't, then I'm probably going to be screwed here. Also, guys, I'm going to need to make a chest room today. That's going to be another goal. So, basically, my major goals is to refurbish this entire area, my uh, sectioned off area here. Um, and get all this situated. Let's go there. Okay, that looks to be good. And, um, yeah, guys, I've been doing really great on Battlefield. Um, I've been playing a lot of that. I've actually I played so much of it. I ranked up, I'm level 11 right now, which is nothing, but, you know, it's good for me because I never really played Battlefield that much. Alright. Let's go in here. And I think this should be good. There's nowhere he can escape from. It is pretty much all lit up here. Let's see if it works. I don't know what's underneath there. Come on, buddy. Get out of here. I'm going to try pushing them out and see if it works. You could also make a pit if you have multiple villagers, but I only have two. So I need to be very careful with these guys. God, that guy doesn't want to go. What the hell is under here? Be careful, guy. I don't want you to fall into, like, lava or something. That'd be freaking crazy. Okay. Um. Oops, I ran out of stuff. Okay, come on, buddy, let's go. Whoops, I finally unblock him, and he doesn't want to leave the freaking place. Okay, um. Alright, let's wait for this guy. The sun's going down, I do believe. Let's see. Let's put a torch up there. Make sure nothing can get in. Looks good so far. There we go. Okay, that looks nice, I guess. <laughs> Not really. Let's cover that up. That's going to be our extra hole over there. When we want to go get stuff. Okay, so I think that is pretty much mop proof. There's nothing in this area that could spawn, from what I know of. Let's just go start placing torches around here. Make sure we're all good. And, um, yeah, guys, since the last episode, it has been really crazy. Um, I got all my Grand Theft Auto recording and uploaded parts uh, done and in the playlist. And, um, yeah, Killzone is absolutely amazing, guys. Um, I've only played the first three missions, I think. I made it to Seattle, which is pretty, uh, you know, it's early on in the game, so I didn't really spoil anything, which is nice. Um... But it's just, the graphics are amazing. It is one of the most Im graphically impressive games I've played in such a long time. Um, oh, wow. I have This is really dark over here. I should probably light this up better next time. Okay, there we go. Wow, we can make so many cool things over here. All right. Yeah, guys, I really cannot wait. I'm going to start doing two episodes a week um, because, you know, this school year is almost over, actually. I can't believe that. I'm on the fourth nine weeks coming up. My grades are looking pretty good. Um, doing good in like chemistry and all that stuff, so that's been nice. Let's just light that up. I don't want anything spawning. I want this to be a mob-proof village, which is my goal. Okay. So that looks to be good. Now all I need to do is work on the roadways and clearing this place up so, uh, you know, nothing can spawn, of course. I don't know. What the hell is this guy doing here? That's the only thing. He just doesn't want to get out of there. That's weird. Oh, well. I guess that's his choice. If he doesn't want to <laughs> leave or whatever. 
Okay, guys, so let's clear out some of this stuff here. Um, I'm going to leave that still like that because I don't want that guy to get over here. The villager. And actually, you know what we could do is we could start a chicken farm in this video too, which would be nice. But first, let me clear out this so this is not all gravel here. Let's make these roadways a little nicer. There we go. Keep clearing this out. And I never, even when I first started this, I never really liked how this uh, went here. Um, how this gravel was all over the place. This is one of the weirdest uh, generated areas I've ever been in, in a village. I don't know why it went like this either. That's kind of messed up. Okay, is there someone in there? Nope, I don't think so. Or if there was a villager in there, he's probably dead now. That's another thing. This village, as soon as I started, the villagers all died. I don't know why. They are exposed to the mobs. Probably should have did a better job of keeping them alive, but oh well. Alright, there we go. Okay, that looks good. All nice and cleared up here. And where is our new entrance going to be? First off, let's get that out of the way. Hmm. Let's see. How are we going to do this? We could make our entrance be up here. Like a stairway or something. Yeah, I'm thinking something like this. We'll go here. <coughs> and then we could go down. Yeah, let's see about this. This might actually work. Here, this is what we're going to do, guys. We're going to go here, up, there. Let me clear this crap out. I don't need a table in my house. <laughs> I'm not a freaking uh, Elder Scrolls guy or whatever. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Okay, let's get that glass. I don't need a window there. <clears throat> Yeah, that looks good, I guess. Yeah, that looks pretty nice. It could be better. It's not going to be a perfect, you know, stairway. All I need to do is mob-proof it eventually. So nothing could get in here. I should probably... I, you know what I could do is add a gate. That'd be nicer. Hmm. I don't know, there's always room for improvement. I'll think about it here. Let's make it like that, though. Hmm, I guess that looks good. Okay, let's sleep, guys. And I will see you back here when I have all my supplies ready, and hopefully that villager started breeding. So, um, stay tuned, guys. Okay, guys, I am back here yet again, and I've sort of redesigned my um, entire house, as you can see um, by the design here. Um, I kind of like it. I'm actually going to add a carpet here, which is what I want to do next. So let's go and get out a little bit of wool, and I do believe we need some dye. And I have plenty of flowers here, so I could change that into something. Um, probably blue dye. Let's get some... Is there any cotton? Or not cotton, wool is what I need, actually. Um, uh, none in there. None in there. Okay, what we can do is make some shears, which is going to be good. Let's get that, and let's get some iron. I think it, I forget how to make it though. It's been such a long time since I actually crafted this. Let's place a crafting bench here. Also get my stuff, place those right there. All right, so that worked out really well. I'm glad, I think this actually looks pretty cool how this came out here. Let's get that iron in there, and um, place a torch there, light this up so no mobs can spawn it. And I'll show you the outside was, a few things I did, I changed a little bit of it. So it looks a little nice. Um, nothing too major, as you guys know. Um, I wouldn't do anything major off camera unless it. I told you guys beforehand, you know. 
Um, okay, so what was I doing? I was making shears, which is right here. Just need two, I think. Shears. Perfect. You know what we should do is we should make a sheep farm in this video, too. Uh, I just have so many things to do. You know what? I think let's do that right now. Um, so yeah, this is the outside of my house, guys. I also changed it up a bit. It looks pretty nice. Um, I'm not sure about this wood here. I'm probably going to change that too. Um, but it looks pretty cool, as you can see. I'm also going to change up this entrance. I don't like how that looks either. You know what? Let's do that right now. Because I'll probably end up forgetting if I don't do it right now. Okay, that looks good. There we go. Nice. All right, that worked out well. Two there. Oh, I see. That's why it's wrong. That's okay. All right, so let's go and get some building materials so I can make another little uh, fenced-off area. Are we? We already got some fences here. That works out well. Let's go and get some sticks here. We will turn this into oak wood. Or not, uh, what is this called? Yeah, oak wood. I don't know why. I thought it was something else. Okay, let's see. Should this be enough? No, we're probably going to need a ton more. Yeah, let's see. This is probably not going to even be enough for how many fences I'm going to need. Sorry if you guys can hear that clicking, too. That's my mouse. Let's make sticks out of those. Whoops. Okay, I think this should be enough, honestly, because I really don't need this much. This is going to be a pretty small, well, not really a small farm. Um, 60 should be good. Let's go and let's make sure this is going to work, though. Uh, first off, I need to get, do I have wheat? I can go get some wheat over here. All right, so let's go and get this. We're going to kill two birds with one stone today. Nice. All right, that's awesome. Um, replant. And, um, yeah, guys, in Battlefield 4, I posted a few gameplays on my El Karloff Facebook page. I'm going to be posting the link down below so you guys can go and check that page out. Um, it is really great. I have a lot of, uh, you know, videos and stuff on there. If you guys are ever interested in going and checking that page out. Um, let's go and make my farm somewhere up here. You know, right next to my cows and horses. Where are my horses? Did they escape or something? I had them tied up. I don't know what the hell happened with that. Oh well. Alright, let's go make a farm right about... Right about here is good. This is a nice little area. Plus I don't have to worry about any mobs spawning. Okay, nice. Let's make it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll make it 9 by 2, 3, 4, 6. We'll just do 9 by 9, I guess. This is nice. Nice little area for the horses to grow. Or, not horses. For the um, sheep. Oh, God. I can't make this today. <laughs> I'm just so tired. I worked a 9-hour shift again. So that's probably killing me. Okay, that looks good. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, nice. All right, let's eat a little bit. And we will go and lure in our animals here. I could actually do this right now. Let's see, is there a crafting bench? No, there's none in there. I thought there was a crafting bench somewhere around here. My bad. I could make this a two-story building, but that's all right. I really don't need a uh, fancy building right now. Wait, what the hell am I doing? See, I'm just so tired. I have no clue what I'm doing. I went to a hockey game, too. I think I mentioned that. It was really good, even though the team I was going for lost one to four. <laughs> so they got totally slaughtered. Um, but that's all right. It was the Youngstown, or not Youngstown, Mahoney Va Valley Phantoms, which is in Ohio, which is where I live. And uh, they were versus the Cedar Valley Rapids. I think they're from Iowa. It was a really good game, too. 
Um, yeah, see, my freaking donkeys and all that stuff. They, how do they escape? It doesn't make any sense. All right, come here, buddy. All right, so at least we're making a sheep farm. I could go get that other sheep over there. And then once I have two of them, I could just breed them, and it'll be perfect. Let's go, buddy. All right, so this is going to be cool. Once we get these guys going, I got my house redesigned. I really didn't, um, I fixed up this village today too, which is another goal I was working on. And I know I said I was going to redesign everything. That's going to come in a later date. Because I don't want this village to, you know, be the main part of this entire thing. Come on, buddy. Come here. Get in. Can you not get in or what? There you go. Okay, nice. Alright, now let's go get another sheep. I think there's one on the other side. Somewhere over here. This video should be uploaded Saturday night, probably at midnight, because I'm by the time I'm recording this, it's 11.02. So it should be later. Um, okay, here we go. Come on, sheep. Let's go. Let's go meet your new buddy here. It'll be right over here. I also need to find the end so I could get the ender dragon taken care of. Come on. Come on. Get up there. Alright, hurry up. Come on, sheep, let's go. Oh, don't tell me he's gonna be like this now. <laughs> this game is so glitchy with this. Come on. Let's go, dumbass. <laughs> he's trying to get out now. There we go, it's working. Okay. I don't know, for some reason Minecraft's really buggy like that. Whenever you try to go and get a sheep, you know, herd him into its cage, <clears throat> um, it works like that. I don't know why. <laughs> Look at all those cows looking at me, wanting some wheat. That's funny. Okay, let's go, buddy. I need to check up on that villager, make sure he didn't die either. Come on, push your fat ass over here. Come on. Let's go, get in. Okay, there you go. Nice, we got it. Perfect, we got a sheep farm now. Awesome. Okay, we are all good to go. And let's see, what else did I plan on doing in this episode? Okay, let's make a chest room. That was my last goal, I think. Um, okay, so we redesigned this area a little bit. I'll work on more of it off camera. Um, I just have so much stuff to do. Um, I'm going to collect so many resources off camera as well. And uh, before we do that, let's go and check on our villager. And then we can go and start on the chest room downstairs, which is going to be simple. Actually, I don't even think we need to make a chest room. Because uh, I'm going to be doing that in my... What's it called? Anyway. Let's go check on this guy. Please don't die. Did he even breed yet or what? Oh, he's still in there. What is his trade? Oh, that's shitty. Okay. Whoops. Okay, um, I'm probably gonna have to redesign that off camera. That's alright. I saw a video on how to make one of those breeding systems. There's one you can make above your thing that floats in the air. Oh, wait, is he doing it? Come on, buddy. Open the doors. Let's see. Oh, he likes the doors. Yeah, that's probably going to work. I don't know. <laughs> he likes the doors. Something good's going to happen. <laughs> He's rubbing his nose to the door. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, man, this game is messed up. Okay. Uh, so, let's see. How many things are we going to need to have here in this chest room? Um, we got three... Br oh, I forgot to brew in this episode. That's what I wanted to do. Well, I need nether wart, and I didn't collect that. Okay, we got a... Uh, What's this thing called again? An anvil with three brewing stands. Three and anvil. Okay, so we could go one, two. We could go two. Hmm. Let's see how we can do this here. Two separate, two separate, two. 
That's gonna be weird. Yeah, that's how it's gonna have to be. Okay. Alright, I got it. So I'm gonna need one, two, three. Three times two, six. So I'm gonna need six double chests. Alright, that's gonna be a lot. Damn, I didn't even realize how much I'm gonna need. Six double chests. I think that's what I said. Yep. Okay. Perfect. We did it, guys. <laughs> Door of the Explorer. We did it. <laughs> God, that's messed up. Okay, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nice. Okay, and then there's going to be a little separation in between, just like that. It's going to be awesome. Look at that. That's nice. And then now I can have my uh, signs going here. That's going to work out well. It's going to be just like season one when I did the uh, other things. Um, do I have any posts or anything? I don't think I do. That's all right. Um, I'll make it off camera guys, um, but basically it's gonna say like stone materials here And then it's gonna say wood materials then brewing materials over there I'll make another wall over there for that too um, But anyways guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. We got a lot accomplished. We got that sheep farm going We worked on that breeding system for the villager uh, Also, we set up this chest room, you know real simply here and off camera, I'm going to collect a bunch of resources. In the next episode, we're going to go and head off to that mountain range and set up a temporary base where we can store all of our materials um, for the mansion project. And I'm going to start doing that foundation for it, too. So thank you so much for watching, and stay tuned for more videos coming from El Kraloff. And don't forget to follow me or on uh, Facebook. I'll post a link in this video description for all the latest Battlefield 4 gameplays and commentaries. Well, not really commentaries, since it's the... Thing hasn't come out yet for the PS4, the update. Um, but you know, that's going to be coming out later. So, see you guys next time.